I can pay the January and February now if you like. What is up guys, welcome back to another video. So today I just thought I'd take you through a vlog and just document the day and just take you along with me because it's probably my favourite type of video that I do make. So um, it's just gone 9 o'clock I think in the morning, or it's just 2 minutes to 9 o'clock. I've just been doing a bit of work. If you watch the uh, morning routine video, like you'll see how I structure my mornings, like what I usually do. So I usually so well go and watch that to find out anyway but um it's tuesday it's just been easter bank holiday weekend and i'm back i had quite a few orders so i'm going to package them all up now take them to the post office go downstairs get a coffee so i don't know if you guys like would be interested in the whole process of me how i package orders and get stuff out so i think i might just actually record it all right so i use shopify it's probably the best like online website platform in my opinion <laughs> Like, yeah, they take a bit of a commission, but he only charged $30 a month. Uh, this is for, like, the lowest box standard rate. You can actually pay, like, I think it's $75, and they charge you less commission. But for me, there's no point at the minute, just because of the quantity of orders I'm doing. It's not, like, a huge amount of volume. So I'm not going to show you, like, the person's details or anything, but you get, like, the orders here. You like the orders, well, it's not even focusing, but so you select all the orders that have been placed. You there's like an app you can use called Fulfill Order Printer, and it just prints off all the orders for you in like with like an invoice. It's free. There's so many apps on here as well that are just free of charge, so they help you out so much. Um, print all the orders, and it will automatically take all the stock out. So that another, if another order is placed, then your stock is like live and you're not like having to update the stock, the stock yourself, which would be very annoying. Um, so yeah, it also takes PayPal or credit cards or any debit cards. Print with order printer. Obviously make sure you've got a printer on. But yeah, it's, like Shopify has made my life so much easier. I definitely recommend it if any of you guys are like selling online, so like e-products or actual products, go and check out Shopify. I'm actually going to link them in the description if you want to check them out. Like, or I would use another website just because of how easy it is. Like, I'm not a web developer or anything, and it's just been so good for me. All I've got to do now is uh, go post office and send them all off. Some go second class, some go first class. There's just a choice at the checkout. So if you want it dead quick, send it like next day. Just have to pay a bit more. Oh, probably my least favourite thing. Paying the supplier, <laughs> paying the bills. So I've got a credit account. So I don't have to pay for like 30 days end of month. So it's like 60 days until I have to make payment which is very nice, which means the cash flow of my company is running smoothly, which means I've always got a steady income of cash. Because obviously the startup, I've not got loads, I've not got massive investment. So like having a credit account helps me out a lot. It means I can buy stock in advance and get samples, and then I don't have to pay through them until I've actually received orders. It's very, very decent. So if you're starting a company, I'd recommend trying to get a credit account with a supplier. Right, I'll, I'll, I can pay the January and February now if you like. I'm gonna go and post all the packages now. The weather is atrocious. A little depressed doggy as well. Hello, because there's people in the house. Hello, it's okay. He's NFs actually. I got caught reading. All right, so. Just finished work and just finished a coffee. Having that as my pre-workout today, just because <coughs> I've not got a monster and 
I just don't want to be having pre-workout every day. It's not great when you have that all the time. But I'm going to be hitting push today. Main emphasis is on the lower chest for me. Uh, my shoulders, I don't really need to do much work on them. Like I'll do some lateral raises, but lateral and rear, but I won't do any front just because when my like front delt is too dominant, you just you, your posture is not great. So I stay away from front delt work. Plus, you're using front delts in any press, basically. So a lot of emphasis on the lower chest, the outer pec. That's where I need to work on. I'll show you a few exercises that I do for that. And later on, I'm gonna get some good meals. But yeah, that's it for now. <coughs> Got this tickly cough, I don't know where it's come from, you know. But it doesn't matter. this now got popcorn massive bowl some dark chocolate and I'm just like doing a bit of online shopping so I'm looking at um, Uniqlo because a lot of you guys have been saying that but also we've got River Island Stradivarius Massimo Dutti a few more brands but I'm just gonna have a look now and I'm also creating a training a free training plan so that'll be live in the next few days. I'll let you know when it is up. One thing that I never really ask is, um, <clears throat> go and follow me over on Instagram. I'm like active on there daily. Like I do Instagram stories. Just take you along on the day usually. It's kind of like a vlog, but on Instagram. And I usually post every day as well. So go and follow me over on there. Fitness tips, fashion tips, food, all that good stuff. Also got a Pepsi Max. Just to curb the craving. Always good on a diet. Such a good food for diet and popcorn. There's a lot of volume. Edit in a vid. Mm -hmm. 